Greetings, I'm Mikhail Zivitz, producer on World of Tanks. What's the reason for implementing three-player platoons and tank companies for non-premium accounts in the 8.5 update? We're continuing to reduce the impact of gold and how it influences the game experience. And that's why we've decided to introduce these new features. Forum users have actively discussed a new plan of being able to buy premium equipment for credits. Is this currently an experiment? Yes, it is. Just like buying premium shells for credits was an experiment. What about buying experience with credits? Will this ever happen? No, this will never happen. That's for certain. How will the light Soviet tanks introduced in the 8.5 update influence the T-50 and T-52? Perhaps these vehicles will become slightly less popular, but their gameplay will not be influenced at all, simply because this line will not compete with the T-50 and T-52. The T-52 is still going to be a top-tier light Soviet tank. Can players expect to see new premium vehicles in the 8.5 update? Yes. This update will add a new premium British SPG, the Sexton 1. Do you plan to make any changes or corrections to the game mechanics in the 8.5 update? Yes, we're going to correct some old and recently arisen errors that may have been obvious to some of our players. For example, having artillery's high explosive shells detonate in the air. This bug was detected in the 8.4 update. As it is right now, the explosion is not shown in the area where it actually happens. The shell can still hit a tank and explode, but a player will see it happen 10 to 15 meters above the tank. We'll also correct another feature regarding HE shells. Right now, when a high explosive shell hits a destroyed tank, it causes no splash damage to the nearby tanks. Now, with the 8.5 update, after hitting a destroyed tank with a high explosive shell, it will cause splash damage as if it hit the ground near the tank. They say the speed of the IS-7 will be increased from 50 to 60 kilometers per hour. Is that true? Yes, it will happen. It's not a rumor. We'll be increasing the maximum speed of the IS-7 to 60 kilometers per hour. Can we expect any new premium Chinese tanks? We'll be adding new premium tanks, including high-tier Chinese vehicles around Tier 8. What about Tier 8 heavy Chinese tank, like the WZ-111? Will that make an appearance? There are no plans to put that tank in the store. It's possible our players may see it appear during special events. Are there any details you can share about the 8.6 update? The 8.6 update will feature many changes. The most important of which will be the expansion of the SPG line up to Tier 10. When testing the 8.5 update, many players noticed the new Tier 10 heavy tanks. What's the status of these particular vehicles? These are not premium vehicles, and they can't be bought in the store. Also, these tanks can't be researched. They are not included in tech trees. These vehicles will be special high-tier content for players. 